Hey everyone, welcome to today's day trading recap for Monday, November 22nd. Uh, nice green day today, plus $656. Only did two trades on our traditional Mighty 90 and runners. One Mighty 90 in Microsoft for plus 389. And one runner in DKNG for plus 267. So let's go over these. And then we also flipped over to our NTT, Navigation Trend Trading Setups, uh, later in the morning. And I'm not officially posting my uh, performance on those yet because we're still doing a little bit of testing, but I'll show you what we did. All right, starting with Microsoft and the Mighty 90, uh, this initial push up pulled back with a little pop in volume here, got long right here and caught this move up. Uh, left a little bit on the table. I think I got off, I got out right here, left a little bit on the table there. Could have gotten more, but as you can see, not too long after that, this thing just fell apart with the rest of the market. So good trade in Microsoft for plus 389. And then DKNG was an upside volume runner. Let's bring up the Donkey Kong. So I had a big push here with volume on this little pullback right here. Got long, got right there, and just caught that move. Really got out of my last piece pretty close to the top. So nice trade there because that thing... Did not trade any higher. So those are the two trades from our traditional uh, day trading strategies. And then on the NTT side, uh, a couple trades here. One, uh, actually one, my big loser was in the NASDAQ. Uh, so if I did come over here, you know, the market was so strong early. So when it was pulling back into these trend candles and into the trend line, I got long right here with a couple big size NASDAQ futures. Uh, when it pushed down and flipped over to a downtrend, I just cut out. Ended up being a loss of, well, I'll tell you exactly, uh, minus 945 on that one. Uh, Bitcoin, did some micro Bitcoin futures here. Uh, pulled back down into the trend candle. Had just flipped over to an uptrend on the, or green candles on the 15 and 30 minute. Uh, got long right here, just kind of it fell asleep for a while and then when it just pushed down a little bit just cut out so small loss minus 89 bucks on that one uh oil and this was after after i got off the live stream took a long in oil here when it pulled down uh got long right here added right here caught that bounce uh when it pulled back here got out uh so plus 580 on the oil trade and then um Lucid. So Lucid, during the stream, I took one that ended up being a loser. It pulled back here, got in right here, added a little bit here. Uh, and then when it pushed down here, just cut out for a small loss. And then shortly after this thing bounced up, you can't see it now because uh, of where the, where the price closed, but it did push up into the candle. So I got short. It was about right here. Caught a monster right there. So net net in Lucid today plus, uh, let's see, what was it? Plus 393. Um, in Lucid, so nice, nice winner there. And then lastly, I am still in this trade in Natty Gas. So flipped into an uptrend, pulled back into the uh, trend candles here. I got long like right here, real close to the bottom. Scaled out of, I just did two contracts, scaled out of one here, up still in one, currently up over 1100 bucks in that one. So uh, up about $1,100 on the day total, but um, I'm, not, I'm not really counting the performance on the NTT stuff. So uh, total profit, official profit on my regular ones is just six fifty six. Uh, we're going to be doing this though. I figured probably I'm going to start probably the first of the year where I'll officially start posting my performance on the NTT trades, just because I'm still kind of working out some of the some of the nuances, and uh, and so we'll probably start then. I'm going to be we're going to be streaming live every day for the first 45 to 60 minutes doing our traditional strategies. Then for the uh, second 30 to 45 minutes of the live stream, we're going to flip over to the navigation trend trading. So we'll be trading live both. So check that out in the live stream room. We're going to be streaming live tomorrow on Tuesday, and then we are offline uh, for the holidays, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, and then back at it next week. So uh, if you guys have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, we will see you tomorrow.